ladies and gentlemen. Oh my. I've been waiting for this moment for. Let me turn this off real quick. Let me turn Jack off real quick. I've been waiting for this moment for. I don't know how long, bro. Like four, five, six months, all summer, whatever you want to call it. We are finally here. Week one. Actually, I'm going to call this week zero. Week zero of high school football season. We are finally here. And we have New Jersey versus Maryland. We got Don Bosco. I'm just calling him. I don't, I don't know. I Usually, like, they're like one or two in New Jersey, one of the top teams in New Jersey or whatever. And then we got Archbishop Spalding, who's also always one of the best teams in the state of Maryland. So, with that being said, we got two of them teams taking on each other for a week zero matchup. You know, they kind of start before everybody else is starting off. But, hey, <laughs> this is going to be a movie. I can't wait, bro. I'm so excited. Oh, my God. Bro, I, yo, you don't know how long I've been waiting for football season. But anyway, we got Mr. Lodge behind the camera. Yes, sir, bro. Oh, we man. back, bro. We back, you yeah, know. Look, you know we I starting was, back yeah, up. Let man. me tell you, I was planning on pulling up nice and fly with some nice shades on today. But somebody, somebody, somebody took my sunglasses tonight. And so, if you're watching this, I know you're not. But I want my sunglasses back. Only, like, anyway. That's very irrelevant to this video. But, bro, I'm going to answer the clip right here, bro. This Campus is packed. Like, there's not a single parking spot here. I don't know how we got this spot. It's not a single parking spot that's open here, bro. It's like, oh my god. And this the game doesn't start for like another 20 minutes. So, it just, uh, we're gonna hurry up and get on out and uh, get on, on the field. So, we'll meet y'all there. Listen, flick man today. You know what I mean? All right, y'all. So, look, we're finally on here, bro. It feels so good to be on the field, like on the sidelines again, bro. It's been so long. Like, I did obviously like a little bit of 707 games and stuff over like the off season and all that, but bro, it's been so long since we've really been like outside on the sidelines for some Friday night lights. And once the sun really goes down and lights really turn on, it's really about to feel like real Friday night lights. Also, this is my first uh, Friday night light game filming with this camera, so a new camera and everything. We're getting a whole new, whole new production for this for this season, you feel me? So it should be something crazy. We're gonna be all over the place. We're going to different places we haven't been before, so it should be a good one. Like I said, we got New Jersey and we got Maryland on one field, so comment down below who y'all got. So you know, rock and so yeah. Alright, so it's like five minutes to kick off and both teams are still inside, so I don't know where they're nowhere to be found, bro. I don't even know if they coming out. I'm like still we might have to line up, bro. Oh, never mind, here come Bosco right here. So look, um, Spartan won the toss. They deferred the second half, so it's gonna be basketball to start off the half, to start the game, obviously. Um, basketball, I think they're going that way, so we're probably gonna end up to going to that end of the field. Kickoff! It'll be first kickoff of the 2023 football season. I, I don't know if y'all like this hype, but I've been waiting for so long for this. And, Finally here, so let's see how this game goes. I have no really expectation for the game. I agree. This year and last year. Back to the kick. Yeah. Yeah. Number four, Bobby. That was close, bro. <laughs> Man, we almost had to pick the first play of the season. Oh, close. Oh, oh, my. Man. Gosh, those are fine. Those might. Defense. 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 
Joe Peck on that sideline. We were having Joe trying to find some way to film from or whatever, so couldn't see too much of that drop. But look, uh, Spartan just forced the punt. So after about four plays on offense, four or five plays on offense for Bosco, they're playing away. Now it's time for Spartan to look at offense and see what they got going. That might have been the longest play the entire game so far. So we are about five minutes in the game. Tom had a gain of eight. It's just been straight nothing but defense all game. So hopefully, you know, for the sake of my entertainment, we get some offense jumping soon. But. Ooh. Okay, I didn't realize I played this four down right there. So there's a little more defense. He's right back to the cab and they're coming this way right towards it, so hopefully they can get some shaking real quick. And they can't. Nope. <laughs> We was asking for some offense, and we got some offense. I can't celebrate too crazy, or I can't like react too crazy, because we're right on Bosco's sideline, it's got torch. Now look, there's something crazy about that touchdown too. I'm going to get to y'all about that one in a second. But real quick, they're going to kick this extra point. An extra point is good. Now look, with that touchdown, I believe that was Aaron that scored that touchdown number 13. He's the first player to ever score a touchdown on a movie TV video in a youth game and a high school game. So two years ago, I went to the Super Bowl game. He's playing for the Columbia Ravens. He had like two or three touchdowns in that game. Scored in that game, boom, boom, boom. Went to high school, played Spartan now. About five minutes into the game, he already had some touchdowns in like that. So, man, um, shout out to 1-3. Yeah, once again, nothing going on. Right now, bro. I don't know. He's got to figure something out. He's That might have been exactly what they need right there. Bowls all the way backed up, found on their territory of the field. All the way backed up and they got themselves a turnover, a turnover on first down, so. They finally got them a little bit of momentum going. Now you gotta see if the offense can do something, because they got like one first down this whole entire field. So. That's what they need. They finally moving the ball. They got the ball all the way down the four yard line now. Now look. They hadn't been across the 50 before this the whole quarter. And so now they're finally on the uh, four yard line. She has to tie it up. Back. To the other side. Nobody there. Now, uh, I don't know why, but my camera wasn't recording at that point. So uh, they just threw a four yard touchdown. <laughs> Right after I recorded that last clip, and uh, they jumped on the extra point too. But uh, I don't know what happened, but the camera didn't record. But I'm gonna see if I can try to find the clip and store it in real quick. Hey, that's the second one now. That's the second time they threw it deep. That's the second time they completed deep, and that's the second time they beat them deep. So. Yeah. That deep ball is looking kind of lethal in this game, so they're hurrying up to the line. They're about to run play right now.
Alright, so look. We were complaining. I, I was complaining about there not being in the office at the beginning of the game. And now we're still in the first quarter and it's been three touchdowns. So this might actually be a little bit of, you know, offensive battle. So I don't know. It depends on what we got going on here. But look. Stoney's office is looking really good. Aside for that one pick and like that one three out the head. Extra point good, by the way. Yeah, aside from like them two plays or two, you know, moments, they look really good out there office. So. All right, so look, uh, that was the end of the first quarter right there. Or yes, there you go. Like that first quarter is ended now. Look, it is second and 18 for Bosco. And they haven't really, they haven't really shown that they can get 18 yards in two plays yet. So I'm very interested as to what they do in these next two plays. Now, look, uh, I feel like this is a huge conversion right here because I feel like if Spalding goes down and scores again. Now, look, the only time Bosco scores on a short field, and not saying they can't drive down the field score, but like, I feel like if, all, if Spalding gets to stop here and it scores again, I just have a feeling this game might get ugly. Like I've seen this before, it starts off looking like, oh, it might be back and forth, but like one team just takes control and if Spartans offense gets rolling like it's been rolling so far, Bosco might struggle a little bit. But um, anyway, we got three more quarters of football, man. It's a little humid out here. My hair's getting a little hot. My forehead getting a little hot. My neck getting a little hot. We're like sweaty, you know, not hot for me. Lige over here in the host. You know, I keep it cool all the yeah, time, man. So yeah. I'm always. Dressed appropriately at all you know, times. You know me. Bro, he looked really official out here, bro. You look like he's been doing this a long time. I have. Bro. I really like, got it. You really I got it. Really like that out here, you know. Come, 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 They try to go downfield, they try to you know, make up those yards they lost in that holding call, but they gave it right back to Spalding. That was a nice play you guys right there too, but he's coming back to hold us and that was going to be first and long just like Bosco had a few plays ago well, on their drive running, so now Spalding got to make it there, you right? And I think they might add some yards into the end of it too for a horse collar. Pulled his whole jersey off his shoulder pad and everything. So now it's about to be first and first and goal low key. He might get this ball like a seven or eight yard line. He's he out here pitching. Another play, uh, Archbishop Spalding. So, <laughs> like I was saying earlier, you know what? Bro, I'm telling y'all, I'm bringing this habit on from last basketball season. Bro, my predictions are on. Oh, no, so. oh. 
That's big too, because now they have to take him off for a play, and it's third down, and they don't have the quarterback this time. Eden Horde, Nick. So. They stopped them all. Like that was fourth down. They stopped them inside. Don't look at them. And it's the number two, AJ Larkin, incomplete. Fourth down. Perfect pass. That's a dot. Kick it, but it's fourth and eleven to go for it. So after what felt like was forever. I swear I just subscribed to you. I saw it on the special. For real? Yeah. Oh, you, saw, you looked up a special? I, I looked up a special. I was just yeah. trying to figure out who you were. Bro, that's Mikey Tough. Man, that's, I appreciate that. Yeah, so this whole video about to be on YouTube. Hey, yeah, I um, so yeah, like I was saying, after what felt like like three hours, it's finally halftime. Um, in fact, what time is it in real life? Let's see. Game started at 7. It's only 8 12. So it's even that long. It felt forever. I don't know why. I'm probably just not used to football games again because I've just, you know, recently been doing basketball games and all that stuff. But look, um, Bosco's defense really came up clutch at the end of that game because Sparta had a chance. To... For your halftime entertainment, give it up for the Spalding. Uh, Sparta had a chance to score like three different times in that second quarter, like at the end of the second quarter. And each time Bosco held it, even like inside the one yard line. So um, that kept it from being like a 28, 21 point game to being only a 14 point game in this uh, half. So. If Bosco comes out here and makes a stop, they just need to do something with the offense. Like, the one touchdown that scored obviously was off of a uh, short field because they had a pick. But, um, I mean, their defense is looking not too bad, but uh, I don't know. There you go, baby. Curtis to the right of Washington. Curtis wow. trying to go all the wow. way here. He's out. Ah! He's so fast. So as we're flipping sides of the field, they had the ball. Carry by number 12. And run for 50 yards. Wow. They couldn't even let us like switch sides with you. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, look at what it is. 
Oh, they haven't been able to guard him all night. They've been torching him all night. Not about to kick X point. What the? Ambulance in the background. There's a lot going on right now. I don't know what. Uh, some. Um, anyway. <laughs> And he held on to it. Third down. All right, y'all. So look, in the third, all the coaches dripped out, bro. Two pairs of fours, some burgundy ducks, some high tops, got some Travis Scotts. Hey, low key, Don Bach. But yeah, let's see how this fourth quarter looks. We could get a miracle. We could get a who we had the first quarter. So you never know unless you keep watching. So stay right there. Fourth and nine from like the 16 yard line. Why they're going for it, I have no idea. Yeah, they, the Lions were saying they have a good kicker, but they ain't kicking field goal all game. They so. have a good kicker, they don't want to use them. I don't know. I don't know. I'm they want sevens instead of threes out here. Ball's going back to Bosco. I just completely lost the ball in that play. I don't know what happened, but touchdown, down Bosco. They threw a touchdown. What happened? Might have just wrapped it up right there. Final score tonight, the Cavaliers 28, Don Bosco 
Four. We officially finished our first game up, yeah? That's a wrap for week one, week zero, whatever you want to call it. Like I said, it's the end of week one, end of week zero, whatever you want to call it. Um, <laughs> I need a light go for this video. I, I ain't put a light go on the video in a minute. Let's go with like 50 or 60, something like that. 55, right in the middle. 55 for the first game, week one. Now look, I don't have any destinations for next week or the week after that, all right? So next week, Friday and Saturday, let me know where y'all want me to see, uh, where y'all want me at. Uh, y'all can comment it, y'all can hit me on Instagram. <laughs> Some of y'all be emailing me. <laughs> I don't really read my email like that, but <laughs> it's there also. Um, so yeah, get to DMing me, get to the commenting. Where y'all want me at next week? Where y'all want Elijah at next week? Because we're going to be outside. We're outside for high school, you know, maybe even some college games, and them youth games too, any age group, you feel me? Hit me. Um, I'm doing this Fridays and Saturdays all season, so. You know I love football season. It's a lot of fun. Um, this is the point where, like, I get to talk, and I don't really know what I want to talk about. So I'm going to just put the camera on Elijah. Make him talk. Um, dang, yeah. Lewis always do this, but, you know, you know how I get to rapping. <laughs> Off the dome. Mm -hmm. um, sheesh. I don't know where we at next week. Lou just hit me normally during the week, but yeah. I'm trying to hit a Dematha game this year. That's, yeah. you know, them boys look really good. When I came up here, seen them a couple weeks ago. Week two coming up, week one coming up, whatever it is. We're going to see y'all there. Hit my 55 likes for me before I blow up, like Jay Main said.